To Be Like Jesus, written by Ellen G. White. Lord, I want to be like Jesus in my heart, in my heart. Lord, I want to be like Jesus in my heart, in my heart, in my heart. Lord, I want to be like Jesus in my heart. Practicing the end time lifestyle. July 24th, do not accuse others, but intercede for them. Therefore, in all things, he had to be made like his brethren, that he might be a merciful and faithful high priest in things pertaining to God, to make propitiation for the sins of the people. Hebrews 2, verse 17. Let human beings subject to temptation. Remember that in the heavenly courts, they have a high priest who is touched with the feeling of their infirmities because he himself was tempted even as they are. And let those in position of responsibility especially remember that they are subject to temptation and wholly dependent on the merits of the Savior. However sacred the work to which they may be called, they are still sinners who can be saved only through the grace of Christ. One day they must stand before the throne of God, saved by the blood of the Lamb or condemned to be the punishment of the wicked. How grieved Christ is by the lack of love and tenderness manifested by his people in their dealings with one another. He knows the words, the tones of the voice. He hears the harsh, severe judgment pass on those whom in infinite love is presenting to the Father. He hears every sigh of pain and sorrow caused by human harshness, and his spirit is grieved. Apart from Christ, we can do no good thing. How inconsistent then it is for human beings to exalt themselves. How strange that any should forget that they must repent and comment with their fellow beings and that those whom they condemn with severity may stand justified before God, receiving the sympathy of Christ and the angels. Let God's messengers act as wise men and women. Let them not lift up their souls unto vanity, but cherish humility. Thus saith the high and lofty one that inhabiteth eternity, whose name is holy. I dwell in the high and holy place with him also that is of a contrite and humble spirit, to revive the spirit of the humble and to revive the heart of the contrite ones. Christ is pleading the case of every tempted soul. But while he is doing this, many of his people are grieving him by taking their stand with Satan to accuse their brethren and sisters, pointing to their polluted garments. Let not the criticized ones become discouraged, for while others are condemning them, Christ is saying of them, I have graven thee upon the palms of my hands, by creation and by redemption, thou art mine. Lord, I want to be like Jesus in my heart, in my heart. Lord, I want to be like Jesus in my heart, in my heart, in my heart. Lord, I want to be like Jesus in my heart. Join us tomorrow for another devotional reading by God's grace. God's way is perfect. All the Lord's promises prove true.